Hey, hey, welcome back to Free Software Tips. So today I have another tutorial on how you can fix the Valorant error code 68 on your computer. So if you're just new in this channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button and bell notification to get updated with the latest tips and tricks on this channel. So without further ado, let's get started. So first solution is to add Valorant on our firewall list. So go ahead and open up your start button and look for firewall. Click on the firewall and network protection system settings. Click on the allow an app through firewall. You can close this window right here. And if you have this button enabled, click first to change settings. And be sure you are on an administrative account. Then click on the allow another app. Click on the browse button and then look for your Valorant shortcut file on your desktop. Click on it and click the open button. It will add a Riot client services app right here. Just hit the add button. If you're shown with this kind of error, just simply ignore this one since it's already on the list of ex exceptions. I'm gonna go ahead and close this one. Look for the Riot client services. And as you can see here, it's check both the private and public. Be sure that both of those check boxes are checked. After that, click the allow another app button again, click on the browse button, and then locate your shortcut file of Valorant, or if you know the installation path of your Valorant, navigate through it, right click on this shortcut file, click on the open file location, click on the right games, it will take you one directory backwards, click on the Valorant folder, click on the live, you'll be able to see here the Valorant.exe application, select that one and hit the open button, you'll be able to see that it will add a bootstrap package game hit the add button if you again see this particular error just simply ignore that one and then look for the bootstrap package game service or app and be sure that both of them are exempted on the both the private and public network next go ahead and click the allow another app one more time click the browse button and then if you're on the same path or our folder just simply locate the shooter game click on binaries Click Windows 64 folder, click on the Valorant Win64 shipping.exe or application file. Hit the open button. It will add the Valorant executable game. Hit the add button and be sure that they are both added as an exception for the private and public networks. Once done, hit the OK button and see if that would fix your game. If that wouldn't still fix your problem, go to your taskbar, right click on your network icon or Wi-Fi icon, click on open network and internet settings. Click on the change adapter options. Look for your network adapter. Right click your adapter and click on properties. Click on the internet protocol version 4 and click on properties. By default, you'll be able to see here that obtain DNS server ad addresses automatically. Check this use the following DNS server and add this particular DNS server IP addresses respectively. Once done, hit the OK button and close this windows. And open up a command prompt by searching command prompt on your start menu. Right click the command prompt app and make sure to run it as administrator. And then type in here ip config space forward slash flush dns. Hit the enter button and it will flash all the dns resolver cache on your computer. Go ahead and try again relaunching your Valorant. If that wouldn't still fix your problem, you could go ahead and download this particular VPN. I have a link on the website. This issue could be possibly caused by internet service provider being in conflict with the servers of Valorant. So go ahead and download and install the Proton VPN. I'll be posting this link in the description on this website. And then go ahead and sign up for a free account on this particular Proton VPN service. There's a uh, paid version and uh, free versions. However, what you only need is the free version. And upon the initial sign up, you'll be able to get a free trial. Go ahead and go to the download once done and download for Windows. Go ahead and install the Proton VPN and open the Proton VPN. It will ask you to log in. I basically log in already. To click on the quick connect button right here. And then go to your Valorant game and try playing the game. And having a far server or country from your origin, you might be experiencing a little bit of uh, increase in latency or ping which might cause uh, some sort of uh, lags or delays while you are in game 
However, this is just a um, temporary fix once the Valorant developers are able to figure out what's the problem. So as you can see, it's now loaded up. So that's basically it. Thanks for watching. If this video was helpful, don't forget to leave your comments and feedbacks down below. And also like this video. And uh, also subscribe for more helpful tips. Till then, see you again on my next video.